the secrets of Neruba. Challenge the might of my empire. This is the second wing. I'll pull up the map in a second so we know where we are. Kill my soldiers. Thousands more will rise. Queen and Surek. A lot of poison. Oh, we got a big fella. Switch that guy. That's him pointed right at us. All right, all right, under control. Jeez, they just keep coming. Getting targeted from all directions. Now I'm fixated. How do we get this guy? Oh, we gotta shoot these things? Your conspiracy is doomed. I uh, better get off this. Jesus, so much happening. <laughs> Surely this has got to be useful. Raise your eyes oh, damn it. And behold the pinnacle of Nerubian evolution. Rush, Russian on. There you are. The feast of bones. Oh. He was there, he's gone. Twisted by Queen Anserek's experiments, Russian on was transformed from a proud Nerubian into a monstrous winged horror. Trapped within a new form, shattered memories of a former self-drive Rashinan into an unquenchable, quenchable rage. All right, so. We are here. If that helps. Tear you apart! The biting rage. Pools everywhere. No. Webs. Savage assault. I imagine I'm okay to stand right in front. Lingering erosion. Uh, what the? Oh, it's like that boss fight. Oh, crap. I hope I actually got to jump over that. Infested spawn? Oh. Let's get that. Come on, Blade Storm! It's going up. Oh. Quick rush! Oh, they're moving. Oh. 
When did that savage assault's meant to be pointed away? Slyly, maybe it's best to just stay on the side. Oh, not again. Oh, they. Oh, crap. <laughs> Jump! Wave of corrosion or poison or whatever. Alright, this time I got my blade storm ready to go. Yikes. That. that seems like something that could have been positioned a little bit further away. That really stacks up. Move again. I don't know what I interrupted, but I interrupted something. Ah, oh, damn it. I blind stormed too quickly. Right over here. Taking ten percent more damage from me. Almost there. Almost there. <laughs> oh, come on. It's nothing left. And die. And die. And die now. <laughs> Jeez. Some finery. Yeah, so sometimes when you do these LFRs, it's a little bit difficult to gauge where you actually... Like where you left off, right? But I think that makes sense. Hang on. Ulagrax, the devourer's here. Yeah, but anyway. What I wish they would do is have a story mode of the entire thing. And it just all flows. Like I would in a normal raid. But, uh, you know, they've done that in the dungeon, so maybe they're building up to that. So I know that there is definitely the final boss, which I think I probably will do for this playthrough. So I'll do... Because I don't think it includes the second last boss. In fact, I don't even know how many bosses are in there. No, there's three. Yeah, so I don't think it includes the uh, second last boss.
another fly point. So I might do the second last boss in LFR and then I'll do the final boss in story mode to see what that's like. None of you shall leave this place. Your desiccated corpses will be a testament to any who oppose me. There is no need for us to entertain this filth any longer. The only thing that concerns us now is my ascension. It's all about her. The Queen's inner sanctum is impenetrable, but her ego is not. Cause enough destruction and the Queen will deal with you herself. Feels like they're trying to lure him back, but I don't know why they don't just uh, LOS pull. The Dark Sermon. Oh, that, yeah, that's a good one to drop. this inscriptions required was a plant for me to pick <laughs> there's a like a crazy spider plant The Silken Court. Blood Twister. So what have we got here? Blood Twister. Nope, we're going a different way now. Oh, okay. So that leads to the Silken Court, which then leads to the final. I don't know why I can't. When I click on this, it doesn't take me to the next map. Oh, there we go, because I've got to right-click on it. Ah. Uh -huh. Oh, what? <laughs> that wasn't... That wasn't my uh, heroic fleet. <laughs> heroic blade storm. So, I don't know if you remember, but I've been mentioning, like, that I was thinking about doing a classic run. And, funnily enough, uh, the 20th, 30th anniversary of, uh, World of Warcraft, of Warcraft, they announced that, uh, there's going to be a classic anniversary. So it's going to start fresh. So it's like, perfect opportunity. <laughs> so I'm just waiting for that now. I did a little poll. Seems like the vast majority of you would like to see a uh, questing series. So I might do, I might do a couple things actually. I don't actually know, I, I, I'm kind of leaning towards a human paladin in classic. Um, but I was thinking maybe I'd do a, like an undead rogue or something. Just a leveling series. Live stream leveling series. 
Uh, or maybe just a questing series, video series, like I normally do. But, we'll see how we go. I'll do the first one and then just see how, how people react to it. to get like the first 10 episodes out and I'll just see see if you do actually want to watch it but it would be I wouldn't mind doing like a live stream as well more casual sort of oh no not so much casual but leveling focusing on the leveling but it would be nice to have a uh, quest series so I can read all the stuff So I like doing the I like doing the season of discovery series like that was quite fun but I don't know there's something about it like couple patches in I kind of lost my interest in it Definitely enjoyed the first patch So I I think it was a good It was definitely a good idea an interesting idea I'm hoping, hoping they take it for that. I hope you actually enjoyed it yourself if you're still playing it. I think it's also that in a mixture of two, so many versions of WoW now. It's kind of tough to keep up. Okay, so this looks like a boss. Blood Twister, are you a boss? Yes, you are. What are you? You're a Blood Twister. <laughs> Twisting that blood. Deep within the bowels of the Queen's Palace, Blood Twister of an Axe conducts abominable experiments with the black blood found in Ashgate. This corpulent, corpulent horror lumbers through the palace's cavernous depths, regurgitating inky sludge into hatchlings to observe its gruesome effects. So it's a worm and it's a bit of a scientist, is it? Alright, so... Injects players with experimental dosage causes eggs to hatch upon reaching 100 energy oh well, too late for that just have to figure it out ingest black blood oh swirly things Experimental dosage, egg break. Destroy egg. Oh, there's like a drip there. Oh, jeez. Adds. Problem is there's so many things on the ground, I can't tell. It's hard to see where that black... The black swirlies are. Plus the boss is pretty big too, it's pretty chunky. What does that mean? Oh. Seeing all these markers everywhere. Oh, we got black blood streaming out. More ads, that's a lot of ads. Oh, come back here. Other ads are down. Oh, look at that stuff flow out. Sp 
experimental dosage. They're using it to destroy, to pop the eggs. And then ads come out. I've got a fixate on me. I don't know what happens if that thing gets to me, but I don't want to find out. So, 50%. Parasites! It's ingesting black blood. Oh, now I'm... I'm an experimental. Just stay here. A worm. Damn egg in my way. It's a little out over there. Jeez. <laughs> it's just stuff everywhere, isn't it? Stuff everywhere that accurately describes every raid. Interrupt that poison burst. That doesn't seem like it'd be a good idea to take. Some victory rushes. Still got these ads running around. Ah. Oh, somebody's already here. I don't know where else to go. Oh, there was one all the way over there, though. Almost there. Almost there. Phew. That was hectic. Yeah, that final one, uh... I guess I should have jumped over there. Well done. The Queen is furious over the destruction of her experiments. Keep pushing. Just glad that it was actually close to death. Ah, oh, Executor. Alright, so now we're going to go back up top. And I imagine, look at all these things. We're going to go that way that they uh, started progressing towards. Oh, I got me a strange mushroom. Requires drill to shop. Come on. <laughs> Something that an alchemist looks like I can finally pick up or use. Denied. Huh? Oh, because you're a paladin, that's why. So why are they mounted up? The cursor hurls an acidic bomb inflicting 352,000 nature damage. And disorienting for five seconds. 
Now, does that go away? I think that... I picked it up before, didn't I? Disappears. When you get to the boss. Oh, well, it's gone now. Oh, there was a time limit on it, wasn't there? You. Oh, I'm getting pulled in the other direction too. nothing. I was hoping our paths would cross, just not so soon. Just, 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 just a sec. Seen too much, just wait. And I cannot leave any loose ends. Nexus Princess arrived in Aruba Palace only recently, quickly establishing herself as a confidant of Queen Anserek. However, rumors abound within the inner court that she may harbor a dark and deadly secret. If discovered, the princess is prepared to dispatch all witnesses without mercy. Okay, I have no idea I what do you do. Not leave witnesses. Apart from that, apart from not leaving witnesses. Hopefully it's just tank and spank. Not for death. Somebody got Monk for assassination. A nether rift. Okay. Don't, don't, don't get taken to the rift. Void shredders. You cannot escape my blade. Jeez. Okay. All right. Rift, rift. Devouring darkness. Ah. All right, it's over. I strike from everywhere. Targeted by Twilight Massacre. I'll just run away. I'm gonna use a defensive. <laughs> Hope for the best. Cut to ribbons. You cannot escape my blade. Oh, okay. Oh crap. Right, right, right. Quick and so we can't to pop that right on the edge. Probably a little bit more spread out too. What is this? Yeah. Starless Knight. Oh crap. Is there something I'm supposed to be aiming for? Maybe just don't want it to cross over and get hit by multiple lines. So if I'm my first assassination, I probably want to go as far away as possible and just kind of spread out a little bit. Because those rifts. We probably don't want to have rips tearing us in every direction. Void take you. Final twilight. Ooh. You cannot escape my blade. The rifts. Boy, take you. Quick and pink. 
Oh, what happens when you... What happens when you go in the rift? I've been targeted. Cut to ribbon. Shadow blade. God. <laughs> Should go nuts. There's the rifts. Devouring darkness. All right, we're progressing here. The stars cannot reach you here. This I can only imagine we don't want them to overlap and hit. We'll just spread them out as much as possible. But because it's all dark out there, I don't think we can go too far. I guess just to the edges. Just far enough. Marked for death. Oh, we don't have much. Don't have very far to run. Quick and painless. Final twilight. God, is that going to be rifts everywhere again? You cannot escape my blade. Oh, good, good, good. Whew. Yeah, we got Exposing the ethereal as the queen questioning everyone in her court. Impressive. But did you believe you were fighting the real thing? I will leave the queen to you. I get paid regardless. Oh, you cheeky. I will let your bounties grow before I collect. Until then, watch your back. We're going to see her in a future raid. Or is she going to join us at some point? All right, we get our loot. So now... Oops. So now we would go down back here and through that door, which would take us into the Silken Court. I did actually get one piece of loot here. Corrosive organ. So I'll have to sort that out. But for now, I'm going to run... Back down to the entrance for the next part. So if we actually have a look at where we started. So we're here. And we went Pulsing Pit, Grand Rampart. So we went. And then I guess we flew up here. To this area. Yeah, so what I'll do... Yeah, okay, so now we go through here. So what I'll do is we'll do the first part of the next wing, and then I'll do the story mode version to see what that's like. So uh, this door's going to open up now. <laughs>